Hey guys, Denis Kozhor here. In this video I want to show you how to create some rug or carpet like this. If you want more interesting videos, please subscribe on my channel, write some comments and give me likes. I will create new file to show you how I make this rug from blank document. I hit S hotkey to create a square or rectangle. Here I will type in 1000 by 1 thousand millimeters and uh, here we can rotate so it folds on the ground. Next we need to split these lines to create them even and accurate. You can use split tool, activate edit pattern by Z hotkey, right click on the line and uh, split. I will choose uniform split and type for number of segments for one and for the second line I will use the same. Next we need to activate internal polygon line G hotkey and uh, double click in the end to create line. You can press shift hotkey to make perfect straight line. Now to select them all I will activate this tool edit pattern. Next I can select everything and with the shift key and uh, marquee rectangle I will deselect these lines and these spots. After I deselect the last spot you can see property editor changed to only faults. And here very important to understand how fold works. If you wish you can check Marvel's manual. Here they explain how folds work and with our example 180 degrees fold flats I will change fold strength so you can see if I activate simulation it doesn't change anyway. If I decrease it by zero lines will move up. If I change it to 360 they fold down and uh, I have nice result that I want it to be. I will reset 3D arrangement to re-simulate it. Now it randomly folds on the floor and uh, as you can remember from the last video I will give link in the description. We can make some other folds and in previous video I speak about how to export it to 3D Max how to add thickness, how to change your topology from triangles to quads and many other useful tips and tricks. So if you don't see it, check it out. If you have any questions, please write them in the comments below the video. Give me some likes and comments if you wish. It will motivate me for recording new videos. Also don't forget to subscribe on my channel and uh, see you next time. Bye.